Hello, welcome to the Spoon Fork Heart Kitchen. สวัสดีค่ะ My name is Jerry. Today I'm going to show you how to make Thai fish cake or for Thai people we call this t o t m a n p a Let's get started. First, we're gonna start with our fish. Today I'm using the hard fish fish. I gonna take the meat out from the bone. Okay, and now I remove the my fish from the bone. Um, you don't have to look perfect because you c a n have to p e l a the meat anyway. Just try to remove all the meat from the the bone. And next, I gonna remove the meat from the skin. Also, uh, in Thailand, we like to use the spoon to to make the because um, we gonna have to p e l a y this. So we have to use the spoon to scoop like this for make it really p e l a y meat. I gonna finish do all this. I and then I will show you when I finish all this. After you finish uh, scoop your fish, and now I gonna use our the plastic uh, wrap to wrap this fish and put in the freezer at least 30 minutes. Forget this fish half frozen. After 30 minutes, now your fish should be half way frozen, and now we gonna start to p e the our fish. Okay, I gonna start to pick. Why have to be um, really cold and h a l f w a y frozen? Because uh, we want uh, our fish cake to be chewy. So the ice cold is gonna help your uh, this the uh, fish cake chewy. Okay, and now uh, we done p e r e e our fish. Next, I gonna start to add our ingredient. Start with our homemade glazed curry paste. This homemade, so it's very fresh and smell s very very good. If you want to know how I make this uh, glazed curry paste, please click the link here, and you will see how I make the f a s t homemade glazed curry paste. Curry, sugar, add a little bit the sugar for balance all the saltiness and spicy. Fish sauce, large egg, and now I gonna start to turn our food processor again so everything can mix it. Okay, and now our fish and curry and all the ingredient is done puree. I gonna remove this to put in the bowl. Turn for to put in the bowl. Our chopped green bean going. t e l e s e l e c t them okay, and add into uh, the bowl. And basil, fresh Thai basil. So the ribs, so you just chop them up a little bit. Not have to be uh, too small. Just chop them a little bit. Okay, add into the bowl also. And next, uh, durian slice. The c a f e lamb, really, really thin. m a s t e r you can because it's very hard to chew this. But um, they go good with the fish. So next, use your keen hand to mix all everything together until the will come by. Here, all I done mix all our ingredient now. Next, all I have to do just deep fry this. All right, okay, and make it easy for not sticking to your hand. You have the cold water is ready. Put in the bowl and just make your hand wet. And now we're gonna make the circles. The oil should be hot, but not supposed to be too hot because uh, all in the ingredient have sugar. If you put it too hot, it's gonna burn. So just a medium, medium heat. Okay, when you fry, make sure you not burn them. Uh, from the just put to the medium heat. And now 
the color a little bit change and if they fall up and you will see when they like fall up and bigger that mean the the fish and the curry and everything already cooked yeah our first batch should be done look they bigger they the double side and then they fall onto the top and the color is change yeah that mean the your fish cake get ready And I gonna continue this, finish all this. Okay, but let me show you quickly. And this is uh, your option. It's a crispy um, basil. You just put it inside here. Sorry, it's a little bit wet. See, you just put a crispy basil. This is your option. This is how we like to serve in Thailand. And for quick and easy sauce, what we're gonna do now? Uh, just use the sweet chili sauce. Pour inside the mixing container and then the use the uh, rice vinegar. I use rice vinegar because they have the a little bit of sweet taste. Not just not too um, sour, not just already sour. After your sauce is mixed well already, so we're gonna add a uh, Bottom, we're gonna add the slight cucumber and uh, a little bit the slight shallot. And now you can pour the salt over. Wow, it's gonna be good. Huh? And some option, lots of peanuts on top. Okay, now I'm gonna have to taste my fish cake. Here, and uh, look at inside. They cook all the way and all the curry and everything. Okay, I'm gonna dip with my sauce. Here, cucumber. Oh, hard to get in. Here. Hmm. Sweet and sour from the salt mm. and uh, I like the fish and curry is very very tasty love it love it love it mm. thank you so much for watching if you like the video if you like the recipe please give me a thumb up subscribe and you will see me for the next recipe thank you